Yo, I hate meeting fine women with boyfriends. Yo, and I hate coming across their profiles on Instagram too. And I mean this in the most respectful yet entitled way possible. But if we in a social setting and you cool but you got a man, why am I talking to you? Why am I even here? Now I can already feel the feminists burning holes in the screen as they watch this. So ladies, let me put this in perspective. Say it's you with the boyfriend, another fella approaches you and you tell him you take it. Would you rather him say, well, so long, or so you can't have friends? My entitlement actually takes a stand against rape culture. The fact of the matter is, I don't want to be friends. I want to leave. If I want to make friends with people I can't cuddle with, then I can go down to the park and play pickup basketball with the homies down the street. Once you say your fine self is taken, my fine self is leaving. And for a few reasons. As I mentioned, my objective was never a platonic friendship. You in here looking like a full course meal. Appetizer, main course, dessert, and free refills. I want something to eat. If I'm at a restaurant and I see the waitress coming with food, and at the last second she take it to another table, I don't ask the waitress to be friends. I play it all smooth like I ain't even see her. The second reason is I don't want to torture myself talking to your fine taking self because the reality is your man is blessed. Blessed I didn't meet you first because this would be a different story. We wouldn't even be here right now. We'd be cuddled up eating seedless grapes and studying Bible verses. Quality time in Jesus name. And the third reason I don't want to be friends is you went and got a whole boyfriend before you even had the chance to meet me. You clearly make bad choices and hasty decisions. I don't need friends like that. I know the single life can feel like suffering when you're seeing cute pics of couples on IG. Your homegirls all booed up in front of you. It's a hardship. But I heard somewhere that hardship produces patience and patience experience and experience hope and hope maketh not a shame but we could have been together if you would exercise that patience because i showed up here single i did my part by the way my instagram twitter snap and all the rest of my contact information is in the description box below I know that Bible verse don't go there, but I'm just saying. Me sticking around after I see the doors closed doesn't make sense. It's like getting to the club and finding out they ain't letting no one else in. You want me to be like Maxwell? I'm standing outside. I think not. I'ma dip out quicker than a UPS driver. You question if I was even there in the first place. 